we're just getting ready getting ready to go to my friend's garage we're going to be working on this amazing machine and we got some amazing amg monoblocks right here mg wheels 18 inch they just need new tires and some love but they they're going to look really good on this car i think you know i think 18 inch is like the perfect size not too big not too small Uh, fail yeah I think it's gonna look really really good with those wheels definitely it's gonna look amazing hell yeah amazing The keys should be inside. Leonid. Man, you guys were looking really good together, you yeah, know, on the on the highway. The yeah, yeah. I was taking pictures of both of you. That's cool. He was complaining that I'm too slow. <laughs> it's right now at, the, at this point. It's okay. You will get faster. Trust me, you don't want to drive too fast with this car because it needs a lot of work now. You know, uh, it needs flex you discs. Lives here now. He is here? Yeah, uh... Oh, there you go. The seat belt. You gotta be safe. What's that noise? Uh, it's probably like the belt. Yeah, it's the it's the alternator. Yeah, we have to fix oh, that. He likes that car. Cool. I think so. <laughs> Looks like he loves it. Nice. They just moved in. Yeah, they just moved in. Nice. Oh, he probably just wants to. I don't know. Maybe he backs it in. Maybe he's gonna back it in. I don't know. Oh, you want back it in instead? I don't know. Does he know how to fix cars too? Yeah, he works on his BMW. Wow. Okay, so we are here. Bunch of work that we have to do on this car. I don't know where to start from. We have to do the engine mounts, cooling system, and all that. Have to detail the interior. There's a bunch of work that we have to do. So we gotta start from somewhere. Still waiting on a bunch of parts to come in, so. You like uh, yeah. classic rock? I do. It's so cool. Does it work well? Wow, so this is all oh, that old school detector oh. <laughs> that we found runs off the battery. That is really cool. Right there. You like it, Leonid? It's, it's amazing. Throw, retro throwback right there. Retro, retro. We love close, uh, classic stuff and vintage. There's a bunch of stuff we have to do. I have to take the battery out. I have to clean. Yeah, it's a new battery. Mercedes too. It's cool. Did you see the old BMW batteries, the leaded ones? What? Are they crazy? I had one, yeah. Did they? I mean, usually they last a while, you know? Yeah, it worked, so. All right, guys, so I have the car jacked up right there. We have a bunch of things to do, 
bunch of work. Uh, today I'm gonna start with draining the coolant, replacing the radiator hose. And uh, the lower radio hose we ordered, so it's gonna be on Tuesday. So there's still a bunch of parts that we're waiting on and I'm gonna start, uh, you know, cleaning the car out and, you know, taking all of this stuff out and everything. So we have a bunch of things to do and take care of on this car. So it's gonna be exciting. Yeah, stay tuned. So the car is all jacked up in the front on jack stands. Okay, so everything is good. Basically, we're gonna be replacing all the suspension components, not suspension, but steering components on this car. Ball joints are also like, they're in need of replacement. Um, and uh, that's because the boots are torn. There's a bunch of things in the engine compartment that we're gonna be replacing. This uh, coolant tank, just a as a, pre a preventive maintenance, uh, radiator hoses and everything. So just a bunch of work that we have to do guys and clean up. All right, so we're gonna be changing these fuses. I'm gonna put new fuses in there because we have brand new ones. So a lot of these are also corroded and everything. So we're gonna replace them with uh, these brand new ones right there. Yeah, it's a weird name. It's <laughs> for some reason it's Tesla, uh, but it's also made in Czech Republic. So that's good stuff. It's not Chinese. Yeah, I like the Phoebe one. All right, so we replaced most of these fuses. I have to install one more right there. Um, so most of these fuses are brand new. Some of them are, you know, the older ones, but they're good. They're like basically like almost like brass. They, they're not gonna corrode. So everything is good. I just left them there for the time being. And then I'm gonna make sure that all of these fuses are correct because each uh, holder has a correct fuse in it. That's really important. Okay, so I just checked all the fuses here and they're actually in the, some of them were in the wrong spots. So I fixed that and put all the fuses in the correct spots. Some of the fuses, like these red ones, there I left them there uh, because I ran out, but they should be still good. They're not aluminum, so they won't corrode. Just have to clean them a little bit, but these are all brand new. I'm gonna drain the coolant right now. This is the old hose, it's literally still original. It's crazy, we're gonna be replacing that. I'm changing this as well. This hose is also old, I'm gonna be replacing that. All right, so I got the intake out, covered everything up right here, have all the hoses out pretty much. Uh, opened up and then now I'm uh, getting to the thermostat. We'll be replacing the thermostat as well So that's that and then just basically cleaning everything inspecting all this stuff as well More coolant coming out So we're gonna remove this. I'm gonna replace this hose right here too. I had to remove the idler arm or idler control valve. And then I'm gonna replace the thermostat as well. It's a bunch of stuff. There you go. Thermostat, okay. There you go. Gotta clean some corrosion here. Cleaning the corrosion right here, and Leo right there is fighting with mosquitoes. Yeah, this yeah. ladybug fucked me up. <laughs> like, what? Uh, this is how far we are, guys. So I loosened all these belts. So we're gonna take all these three belts off. And the noise that was making this this engine was making was actually because of just uh, this air pump that just fell apart. It's no bueno. So we're just gonna, at the moment, we're just gonna take the belt off of the pump. We're gonna kind of run it uh, without the belt, basically. It's not a big deal. 
in the future we'll figure it out at least we can get rid of this noise for it now um yeah other than that uh we need to replace this belt and i forgot to grab it today from the store so probably tomorrow and we're i'm gonna get ready to clean all these cooling system parts and engine compartment <laughs> 